Siddle back in the attack, bowling to Marsh, who's bowled! First ball of a new spell with a brand new ball and Sean Marsh's innings comes to an end on 115. The stumps exploding. It has been a wonderful innings from Sean Marsh coming in in just the third over of the day and he walks off at five o'clock in the afternoon. Ooh, of needs. And he's got him. He's got him. I heard a noise. I think it was a stumping. It was very close to the edge of the bat too. We'll watch this replay. It was in the end. I think he's just gone right through him. It's gone right through him. And I think he'll go down with the stumping we watch. Yep. Bolding. It's gone absolutely. He's got some bad on the way. Oh, it's gone through and bowled him. Nothing worked there for Curtis Patterson and Swepson had the answer. So the second wicket falls. A little bit of a shock there for the New South Welshman. It's almost like he made up his mind before it was let go. It almost looks like a flipper here and Patterson really at sixes and sevens just trying to waltz down the wicket and defend. And in the end, a delighted bowler. So Swepson picks up the second wicket since lunch. Have a look at it. Looked like a flipper. He's walked right past it, the top of off. Figures a five for 50. Oh, he's got six for 50. Yorker, through it goes. The bales fly in the air, and the South Australians have lost that valuable eighth wicket. Boland, absolutely magnificent. His display with the ball has been breathtaking, and that delivery, equal to any that he sent down today, that crashes through. South Australia have two wickets remaining and they lead by just six runs. It needed a special ball to go through his defences and that was a special ball from Scott Boland. It swung back late, almost Yorker length. A sign. Oh, very similar. Another one. Pretty much back to back, a replay into real scenes. Peter Siddle, what a delivery to Henry Hunt. Well, you wouldn't think Lightning would strike twice in the fa in the within 24 hours, but uh, Henry Hunt, who hasn't had a lot of strike today, becomes the second victim of the Wiley veteran. Peter Siddle, great piece of bowling. Let's have another look at it. And this time he plays, but takes uh, off stump, and that just straightens slightly. We'll have a look at it, and you see the, the bales fall off there. Get the Australian Test captain out just yet. <laughs> oh, he's knocked him over. Tim Payne's bowled. Butler provides the breakthrough again. He's in sensational form. Tim Payne dismissed from Bartlett for the second time in the match, and Tasmania are on the ropes. They're six down. What a tremendous delivery, angled in, straightened down the line and he's knocked over the Australian Test Captain. Beautifully bowled Xavier. And Bartlett has six for the game. He's filling up his bag. And the Australian Test Captain is on his way. Oh, very close, it's bowled him, has it? gone through him. Kawaja just stood there for a while, couldn't believe it. I thought it had wrapped him on the pads, but it actually gone through the gap and into off stump. Great delivery. Yeah, that's a, that's a beauty by Abbott. He's bowled him. Swepson's got through the defence of Daniel Hughes. That ball kept a little low and Swepson gets a wicket in his third ball of this over and this spell. Good move. Well done, Usman Kawaja. Well done, Mitch Swepson. Bowling into that. There's not much rough out there, but certainly getting this one to... Look at the turn there. Oh. Prodigious turn. Look at that.
Daniel Hughes Beautifully is bowled by Mitchell Swepson for 16. Dan Hughes is castled. In Here comes Rain Bird. And he's bowled him! He's gone straight through Cameron Bancroft with a beauty. That swung back a mile down the line. Bancroft was aiming a drive. His feet were all over the place and now so are his stumps. A wicket for Tasmania and a wicket for Sam Rainbird. One for 11, and that's a critical strike in the shades and shadows of Stumps. Well, that came out of the blue, Jacob. That uh, brilliant delivery from uh, Sam Rainbird. That ball swung in late, and uh, all ends up, Cam Bancroft. Well, bowled him, knocked him over, and the change of angle works for Mitchell Swepson and a much-needed wicket for the Queensland Bulls. Sean Abbott out after a very, very good innings. Bull just clipping the off stump, and he's on his way. Well, that's just one of the best deliveries you're going to see this weekend of Shield cricket. Look how far that's turned. Knocks the top of off stump, and Sean Abbott, who just wanted to defend, he didn't want to do anything more, 